Now, before I start recording and uploading the C++ programming series, I need to do a video on how to download the programming software that you need to follow me. Now, if you already have a C compiler that you're comfortable with, then I will recommend you use that. But if you want to follow me step by step in the video, then you will need to download Visual Studio 2010 Express. The best part of this software is that it is free for non-commercial projects. Starting at the Google homepage, what we want to do is type in uh, Visual Studio 2010 Express into the search bar. Now, you want to click on the link that says Visual Studio 2010 Express Products. This will bring you to their homepage where you can download the current version or download the old version and we're going to download the old version which is the 2010 Express. Here we have two options. One is to download the ISO and if you know how to mount it then you can just download that. But we're going to download um, the easy one which is the Visual C++ 2010 Express link instead. So we're going to click on that. After that you want to click on the blue square and it's going to try to get you to download the new version the second time. But we want to download the old version by clicking here. After the file has finished downloading, we want to browse to the location of the file. The file that we're looking for is named vc underscore web and we want to right click on it and run as admin or you can open it as well. At this point it's unpacking the files uh, to run the installer. I'm not going to send any information and I'm going to click on next. I'm going to agree to the terms of service and I'm going to click on next. And I don't want to install any extra features. And I'm going to click on next. Now verify the install path. And I'm going to click on next. At this point, um, it's going to download the necessary files from the server. And we're going to fast forward. After it has finished downloading, it's going to go through and install each file, which can take a while. So we're going to fast forward this as well. At this point, uh, 2000 Express should be installed. Uh, just click on exit. It does not make an icon for you, so here we're going to create a shortcut on the desktop. So just copy the link here and then paste it on your desktop and move it to a location that is more convenient. You can start up the program by double clicking. Now after it's done with that, you will be taken to the Visual C++ homepage. And this page will look very familiar to you um, if you stick with the programming series. Thanks for watching and 
I uh, hope you look forward to the series coming out.